What's good, y'all? This girl Nancy here, and um, just getting back from the um, Popeyes, and I talked to the um, personnel. Want me to come back Monday? I'm like, fuck, Monday, bro. Really? That's all the way finishing this week and going to next week, and I want me to come through that day, feel like some paperwork, and see when I can get started. So basically. I got the job, it just got to wait all the way until then, which is some BS, but um, it is what it is. So, it's about to go ready rain, so I'm trying to help get my ass home on a slow ass fucking mountain bike. It's the slowest mountain bike I ever had, but you know, it is what it is. Um, it's better than nothing. But anyways though, so, I'm going to come do that day. And I called up that racist ass Dollar Tree, and apparently the other bitch answered the phone, and she said Amy would be back in the morning. So I talked to that motherfucker in the morning, and apparently she said the truck already came through. And Amy said she'll text me when she find out when that bitch coming through. So I'm like, okay, hmm, all right, I see how it is now. So I got that bitch. Like I got another um, place I got a file for. So that's what I'll be doing. So I got two places to file a play or uh, report or whatever on. And um, yeah, so I'm just trying to contact them people. But as you already know, motherfuckers either closed or saying that they are too busy to answer calls right now or whatever. So it's BS. Anyways, though, all I could do is see, try to contact the people so I can file and get those two places. But um, besides that, things are going good. I was going to stop at the other place, but they're closed today. So I'm going to see if they open in the morning. And um, I got to see what time a man wants me to be there for uh, Monday. Because I don't remember. I don't think he said the time. He didn't say be there for Monday. But I'm going to just call probably late on today or I'll just call sometime in the morning or whatever to see um, when he want me to be there so <coughs> hopefully they ain't transphobic there I see they got a lot of uh, youngsters in there which are probably ignorant most likely because like I say 80-60% of people around here are so uh I guess I'll just see how it goes. Better than not having no job, you know. Just deal with the fucking hate and racism. To get something better. But, um, just trying to get my shit started. So I won't have to work for nobody or deal with that bullshit. You feel me? And I'll be getting up when I want to. Going to sleep when I want to. And go to work when I want to, basically. So, can't wait to get to that point. All I gotta do is keep trying. And, uh... Why I haven't gotten to that point all this time? Because I'm not given the opportunity. No LGBTQ people around here are given that opportunity. You got to make your way. You got to make your own shit. You got to keep fighting and pushing. Why everybody else ain't even close to your level and they get into these opportunities just by being a gift to them because they straight or because they ignorant or this and that. So... They get those opportunities. Even though they don't deserve it, they get it. So, while people who are able to do all that and know what they're doing, even way, way more experienced and older, they don't get that opportunity. You gotta fight for it. So, that's what I've been doing. Past last year and starting this year, I'm just fighting harder this year. So, that's all you can do. Anyways, we'll let you know. What was going on? So basically, want me to come to Monday? So I gotta wait all the way to next week, and then Sunday, Saturday, or whatever, and then Monday. So I'm just waiting till then, and hopefully fill out the paperwork, and yeah, give me a um day to come in, and that'll be it. So it seems like it went good. Yeah, it's a quick um interview, but you know. It's all good. Anyways, though, yeah, have a good one. And peace.